So we're going to take a walk and uh, look at a few of our units here on the insides at Hyde House Lofts. And we're going to start with a three bedroom townhome. If you remember from the construction videos, each of these townhomes, they're two stories. They face the street and, uh, and they have a private entry. And half of these units have double decker, two story decks, which are really fantastic. And all of them have this nice private entry that uh, you can put a grill on, etc. Let's take a look on the inside. Four of the townhomes have um, basically a bedroom, a living room, a kitchen, bathroom, etc. The intention here is that these are really our live work units at High House Lofts, and the idea is that we put down all hard surfaces, and this is a uh, concrete effect, uh, stained concrete effect on the first floor here, and it continues into the bedroom. And several people are using these smaller ground floor bedrooms as studios and workspaces. And so if, let's say, an architect or uh, an artist, uh, artist wants to live and work here, they can have clients come into the front door and conveniently have their workspace on the ground floor. So there's one bedroom on the ground floor, a full bath, and the same design as the rest of the units. We have this really fantastic uh, dark laminate cabinetry that we got custom built right here in Milwaukee. And then uh, we have these uh, Make countertops and nice lighting packing, etc. High efficiency fans that are pretty interesting. There's a, they're on a timer and they actually provide some humidity control and some circulation that you can put on for several hours. It's just one of the interesting features that our HVAC contract we did here. So here we are in the living room and then uh, has kind of eat in the kitchen. We were able to buy all stainless appliances, which really brought together the look of these units. You can see that these are. Really nice quality, uh, real cool stainless appliances, um, and we've just been getting a lot of compliments about the overall design. Very Eurotech, very modern, um, and just really a lot of cabinet space, and, and just really uh, um, very practical. As we head upstairs, this is the front door that's that's near the stairs off the kitchen, and this front door actually goes into um, into the hallway, and so this is your connection to all the common areas, and also if you have underground parking come up uh, on the elevator, take the stairs up to the ground floor, and come in your front door off the hallway. Otherwise, the stairs, pretty neat on the inside of a unit to have a staircase like this, a private stair, and there's no connection to the second floor into the hallways. This is really just a private upstairs. It lives just like a townhome would you'd see in an urban setting uh, in the street. So you have two bedrooms up here, um, your, your typical you know, second bedroom. And then the master bedroom has a larger window set. And half of the units is pretty neat. This actually is a French door out onto the balcony. But in all these masters, we have a really nice, large walk-in closet with plenty of space on these wire shelves. There's a lot of storage in these units in general. And then up here, too, in the townhomes, uh, we have a laundry. And so, little laundry room tucked in up here. We provide the washer and dryer. And so that works out real nicely. And then here's a shared bath on the second floor that has a bathtub. So uh, we have been finding that families are moving into these units and so uh, we have showers on the ground floor and a tub, you know, shower module on the second floor of the master unit. So same design as the rest of the bathrooms, but uh, really look really came together and uh, really pleased with this.